Hi everyone, it's Kennedy and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my night routine as a sophomore in high school. So it's currently 7.14 p.m. right now and this is usually when I start like my night routine and everything. If you don't already know, I do school online. I started school around like 10 a.m. and finished around like 3 p.m. It usually takes me about two to three hours to do school but it took me a little bit longer today because I've been slacking up my schoolwork recently because life has literally been lifing so hard. Like it is insane. It's just a lot going on. And I've also been slacking with YouTube and I'm so, so, so sorry. I literally feel so terrible when I'm not filming or like uploading for you guys consistently. And I'm going to try to be as consistent as possible. Basically, my night routine is different every single day. So I'm just going to be showing you guys what my night routine is tonight. The first thing that I usually like to do is do like my house chores if I have any for that night. Or clean like my room after the dishes. And I also need to clean my room because it is a mess right now. I did clean a little bit like earlier, but then I filmed another video and my desk is a mess and like also like my floor and everything so i want to clean that up i feel like a clean room definitely equals a clean mind i feel like when i go to sleep around mess i just have the worst sleep ever i just hate sleeping around a bunch of mess So I just finished the dishes and now the next thing that I'm going to do is clean up my room. So it's honestly not that bad. Like I'm just going to take it. It's not that bad because I know you guys know my room can get super, super messy. But this is what we're dealing with right now. It's not even that bad for like me. It's just kind of like my desk area and then like under my desk area. And then these are just going to stay here. I haven't put those away yet. And the floor and stuff over here. And then that's pretty much it. My bed is all cleaned off. There's no more laundry on it. And then I'm also going to vacuum my room and then put a new like scent thing in like one of those like febreze scent plug-in thingies because i just love how it makes my room smell and i want to put a new one in because that last one is running out i think and then i also might just clean off my vanity mirror too because this has like a bunch of like fingerprints and stuff on it. i feel like that's just i hate that when it has a bunch of fingerprints on it so so first i'm going to clean off my desk area since that's like the main source of the mess i'm currently re-watching alexa and katie literally best show ever if you haven't watched it yet you need to go watch it right now literally best show ever i'm on season three and i just started it like restarted it i think two days ago and on season three so i'm gonna watch that while i clean up my room because i just cannot clean in silence if you do that i don't know how because i just cannot Before we continue on with today's video, I wanted to mention that today's video is sponsored by Queen Rose. So thank you so much Queen Rose for sponsoring today's video. Queen Rose is a quality focused budget friendly mattress and sleep essentials brand. They were so kind enough to send me their new mattress. This is their new cooling memory foam mattress in a size king. This mattress has a pure foam design with medium firmness suitable for various side sleepers. The mattress is firmer in the middle and softer on the sides providing excellent lumbar support and preventing morning back pain. Right now I'm just adding some new fresh sheets to my bed since I just cleaned my room. I always like to have a nice clean room and fresh sheets. I feel like it's honestly the perfect combo. There are so many amazing benefits when you periodically reset your bedroom. A clean and organized bedroom reduces stress, promotes relaxation, and improves sleep quality. Also, an aesthetically pleasing environment enhances your ability to unwind and enjoy your space. This mattress is so soft and comfortable and it has literally changed the game for me when it comes to sleeping. I've had my best sleep on this mattress since I bought it. Like, it's unreal. If you guys are looking for a new mattress, I definitely recommend trying out queen rose's new mattress and if you happen to be looking for a new mattress i do have a discount code for you guys you guys can use my discount code kennedy for 10 percent off when you place an order with queen rose once again thank you so 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 much queen rose for sponsoring today's video and all of the information for this mattress will be linked down below in my description box
Okay, so I finished cleaning up my room. I vacuumed, cleaned my desk, and then also put um, new sheets on my bed. My pillowcases are still washing though, so I couldn't put those on my pillow yet. But now I'm about to get in the shower. So what I'm gonna do is just put my hair in a claw clip and then just put my bonnet on. I'm just gonna give you guys a little recap on my day because why not? So basically, I woke up like pretty late today. I woke up at like nine, which is like late for me now because I'm waking up at like eight o'clock or I sit in the bed for about an hour. I'm putting these clips in because the two front pieces of my hair always fall out of my bonnet and then I did school for about a few hours and then I cleaned up a little bit like my bathroom and my closet and then I filmed and then now we're here. Okay, you guys, so I'm about to do my nighttime skincare routine. I'm so excited because I love doing my nighttime skincare routine because it just helps me unwind a little bit more and it makes me feel ready to hit the sheets and go to bed. So first up is my skincare headband. So I'm gonna give you guys my in-depth nighttime skincare routine. So first thing I start off with is a toner. I like to use the Ordinary Glycolic Acid Toner. I don't use this toner every night because it is super, super strong. So if I'm not using this toner, then I'll use the Ordinary Milky Toner because it's much more subtle. It's not as strong as the Glycolic Acid Toner. I use this toner more for like texture and stuff. And then this one's kind of like my more everyday one. I like to use this like three times a week. Okay, next I'm gonna go in with a serum. I like to use the Ordinary Hyaluronic Acid Serum. I love this serum so much because it makes my skin feel super, super hydrated, especially after using this because this can really dry out my skin a lot because it's more of like an exfoliator type thing. So I always like to go with like a really hydrating product afterwards. Stuff makes my skin feel so hydrated and this is definitely a product that i will continue to repurchase because it's that good next i like to go in with this dark spot gel from verse this is their out of sight dark spot gel and i literally had told you guys about this before and i am obsessed with this this helps so much and my dark spots have lightened up so much ever since using this Okay, next I'm gonna go in with this Kiehl's Creamy Eye Treatment with Avocado. I love this eye cream so much. So I'll just put it under here. I like to put a good amount. I like to lather this under my eyes. What's next? Oh, moisturizers. I'm trying out this Curology Cream Moisturizer. I'm gonna try this out. It's kind of like a push thingy, which I've seen like a lot. But I love doing my skincare routine. My skin just feels so good after like, it just feels so alive. My hair looks so crazy. Do not even mind that. I literally look a hot mess and I need to fix this. I might do sock curls again tonight. Last thing that I'm gonna do that's part of my routine is put on this Glow Recipe Hyaluronic Gloss Balm right here. And now my skincare routine is done. I love how my skin feels after I'm done. Like it feels so juicy and just plump and hydrated like, Okay, so I'm in my room now and I'm eating dinner in bed. Usually I would eat dinner with my mom and my sisters, but I have a lot of studying to do and just extra schoolwork I have to do. Um, so I just thought why not eat dinner in my bed tonight and study and do schoolwork. So basically my mom just ordered this food. So we have mashed potatoes. I think this is coconut shrimp and then broccoli and a lemon butter sauce. And then we have some clam chowder, which is so good. I haven't had clam chowder in so long. Okay, these are just some oyster crackers. So I just like a few in here. But sometimes it can be too much and they just get soggy too fast. And yeah, this food is literally so good. So I think I'm gonna eat my dinner first and then start studying and doing all my schoolwork because when I have good food, I need to enjoy it. I cannot be working on geometry while I'm eating this coconut shrimp with my lemon butter sauce. 
I finished eating my dinner. Now I'm gonna get started with my schoolwork. So, so I think tonight I'm just gonna work on some geometry. So these are what my notes look like. I like to have them color coordinated just because it keeps me more organized. These are what my notes currently look like. So yeah, I'm just going to write some more notes. I have to write a bunch of notes, especially for this class because we have like an assignment called sample work for every unit. So basically you submit all of your notes to that like Google Drive or whatever as your sample work assignment. And it's worth like a lot of points. So I need to make sure I write like enough notes. I think you have to have like a certain amount of notes written for each unit to get like the credit. In the bathroom now, I finished doing my schoolwork for the night. So right now I'm about to do some sock curls. Like I mentioned earlier, I do have to take pictures tomorrow. Um, so I need my hair to be done. And my hair right now is just giving like gross. So we have to fix it. So what I'm gonna do first is just brush this out so there's no knots or anything. I've done these three times now and I think it's always hit or miss with these so I don't even know if this is going to turn out good but fingers crossed it does because I have stuff to do tomorrow so if my hair looks a mess then you have a big problem. So it's now 12 44 a.m right now and i'm about to go to sleep i'm so 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 tired right now so that is the end of today's video hope you guys enjoy i know it was a short one but longer videos are coming just bear with me please but i hope you guys enjoyed today's video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one bye